factoring with repeated use of the difference of squares formula. The difference of squares formula says that if we have something squared minus something else squared that it will factor into the first one without the square minus the second one and then the first one plus the second one again without the squares so we're kind of dropping the squares going from left to right so we're asked to factor this and the first thing that we should notice is that there is a common factor amongst both terms this one and this one they both have a 3 and they both have a u3 in common so if I'm factoring that out I would divide each one by a 3u cubed 3u cubed and see what's left so in the first one the threes cancel the u cubes cancel I have just the w4 and in the second one the u's cancel and the threes cancel leaving me with minus one so this middle term here this last term is in the format of a difference of two squares and just to help us see it a little bit better I'm gonna write it as a w squared squared minus one squared so that we can see that it is a difference is subtraction and each one is being squared so using that formula at the top to factor it I'm gonna first bring down that 3 u to the third and then since the other is a difference of two squares I'm gonna drop the squares and write it as w squared minus 1 dropping the squares and then I have to do the plus as well w squared plus 1 now the instructions do say that it's repeated use of the difference of two squares and that's because in the middle here we still have something that looks kinda like the difference of two squares it is a w being squared minus a 1 being squared I could think of it that way so bringing down that 3 u to the third and then applying the difference of two squares formula to the part in the black here says that it is the difference of the first and the last one dropping the squares and then it's the sum of the first and the last one dropping the squares and of course this guy out here just needs to come down I don't want to lose that factor w squared plus 1 the reason we can't do the formula on it is because it's the sum of two squares and not the difference so we have factored it at this point 